Thursday break doesn't officially begin for another week or so, but for North Mississippi school children, they are getting a holiday today. The 16th annual school day game, Louisiana and Ole Miss from the pavilion on the campus of Ole Miss. 135 school buses, the expectation, almost 9,000 kids inside the pavilion. Creates quite an atmosphere. Beth, she's an asset to this team. Long some good minutes in the last game. It's having a good game so far. Marate off the window. This is on the board. Good ball movement there. Really good ball movement. That's what Coach Yo wants to see from her team. But like you mentioned with the freshmen, these freshmen are logging some really good minutes early on. Great move there. Another good possession with ball movement. Uh, it was a good in and out game. Good job by Doucette with the court awareness. Crystal Allen lets it fly. She's got five, and Ole Miss takes its first lead. Last time these two teams met, Louisiana got its first ever win in the series. Mimi Reed with the bucket. Shot clock at five. Dunlap from the free throw line. Good luck. Inside, Cecilia Muhate. It up and in. Three on the way for Mimi Reed. Almost a set shot that time for Reed. She said to him, if that's what you really want, then let's go for it. Not you go for it, let's go for it. And they did that. She's talking about one of the best scorers in the SEC for the first couple of years of her career. She still shows those glimpses. She dropped the knee brace a few games ago. How about another one? <laughs> it's like, welcome, welcome back. It's a pretty good scoring team. Crystal Allen. Ornoyer lets it fly from deep. It's her second three of the afternoon. 23-point lead. Ole Miss trying to close this one out. Up with six and a half to go. Having another triple for Shandrika Sessom. The 25 points in the second quarter, the most they've scored in a quarter at any point this season. And the Rebels are going to improve to five and six before heading to Ruston to face the Louisiana Tech coming up this weekend. Yeah, this is a nice game. Several players, double doubles, and nice that it holds true to form that haven't lost a kids game yet. So the most exciting game, I think, of the season. So really good win.